Hello again. We go on with this game, and as we know, Kumasi and Antanarivo are going to fall to my neighbor. So I put uh, Amani here. She's going to give influence to these two cities. Uh, uh, New York is also less than nine tiles from this city, so I'm going to also give some influence to New York. And so, but eventually these two are probably, at least Antanarivo is probably going to revolt, become a free city again, and then I can invade it and liberate it. Um, so that's going to be fine. Um, I will recover this one. And in the meantime, I will lose some culture, but I'm building a lot of stuff that gives me culture like all over the place. Like this. The zoo is going to give me some much needed happiness. Uh, we are not so well there. So yeah, a lot of stuff that gives me more culture. So I'm going to compensate for losing those city states. Um, then uh, my ally, the green Congo, is going to invade Delhi apparently and uh, if this works that would be awesome because then this guy first of all Gandhi who's leading the religious war right now would become super weak by losing the capital that would be great I'm not scared about uh, the Khmer becoming too powerful and spreading Buddhism all over the place because I can just declare war on them they are far from me so uh, the fact that I don't have almost any troops is not a big deal I can still declare war on them and use my few troops to just go around and uh, kill all of the religious units that he sends my way. So he's definitely not going to win a religious victory, but Gandhi might have done it. Now, if this guy gets Delhi though, that's not going to happen. And also this guy will be uh, will have a border with this purple Congo. And this purple Congo might attack me, you know, they, are, they have a bunch of troops here. I have to build walls already. I have a crossbow course here, which I'm eventually going to upgrade to field cannon. We're going for steel to get Eiffel Tower and to get uh, fortifications. And uh, what else do we need to know? Oh yeah, we have we have this martyr here. Is this a martyr? This is a martyr. So we can get the relic if he dies, which he will do. Um, I need to move this stuff. So I have some room. Oh, I cannot move this stuff on this turn so that's a problem because i need i need room for my relic uh, let me see we are getting we're getting an art museum in one turn so let me try to run away for just one turn and then i will go back up there all right so this should be good enough yeah, no, I'm not going to spread Hinduism. Hopefully this is going to be good enough. And, um, oh wait. Oh no, this is a, this is a Hindu apostle. So he can, he can actually protect the martyr for now, until I have room for the relic. Yeah. And so, yeah, because I think if, if you, if the martyr dies and you don't have room for the relic, you don't actually get it. So that would suck. Um, okay then. So next turn. Yeah, I think we're we're fine now. Trading post. Okay. And oh, I forgot to to put my my clock. Okay, let's put the stopwatch so I don't make this video super long like the last one. I completed a trade route, so we have more era bonus. I need six more points for a golden age. Uh, but I only have 13 turns left, so it doesn't look like I'm actually going to get it. I'll leave another unit here just in case. And uh, yeah, I'm going to need to upgrade this guy to fill cannon and get a few more units up there, probably. Congo has completed research on rocketry. This guy wants to buy coal. And I think I'm going to sell it to him because I will have more eventually. And um, and I'm not using it right now. And I'm I'm okay with this guy not being too weak because, uh, yeah, you know why. Anyway, there is an emergency. Okay, emergency against the purple Congo. This is the guy who took Kumasi. So the emergency is about liberating Kumasi, which I absolutely love. Um, problem is I don't have any troops, so we'll have to reject it, I don't have a chance. It would be awesome to actually liberate Kumasi and get all of this stuff. 
yeah, four thousand gold plus one gold for return for each envoy. That would be awesome. Um, problem is, I can't really go for it, even if it doesn't have walls right now. I just don't have enough troops. Uh, okay, this guy is established. Okay, that's all good. I have moved all of my governors in the previous video. So this lady is now here and she's giving me what in my capital? Let's remember, no it's not this one, this one. She's giving me plus 100% tourism from great works of art, music and writing. So that's pretty strong. Still though, I will have to move one of them here so I can get a relic. Uh, so, you my friend. I'm going to try to meet a Buddhist apostle, so you can die, basically. Okay, there you are. Kumasi has been defeated. Yeah, I obviously lost the suzerain status because the city is just gone. Do I want to get this? I have two universities right now. I will have more. I have very little science, so... I will eventually have a university here. How are we doing regarding great scientist points? Actually, not so bad. I might actually get this. What is this? Uh, mm, that's not so great, actually. Alfred Nobel is not my favorite. 23 points at this point. 20 points is, is very little, so it's, it's not um, a major factor here. Do I want a factory down here? Could be nice, but... Maybe I need other things first. I could do one of these things to get those, uh, I think, malls or one of those buildings that uh, actually do give you tourism. I could get the Bolshoi Theater, but um, it's gonna take forever. Shipyard here, that's another three production. I could go to Shipyard and then uh, Bolshoi Theater. Builder down here? I don't think so. I mean, do I still have the Builder extractions? Six turns, I can get in four. Okay, let's go that just to use uh, that uh, policy a little bit more. This guy will go down. And then he will upgrade to something a little bit better than that. Okay, let me think about this. Who needs more production? This guy, all of these northern guys need more stuff. That being said, I really want to send a trade route to my ally, for sure. Who didn't conquer Delhi just yet. What if I wait one turn? Well, maybe Delhi falls again and it becomes a free city, so... That's not so good. 14 gold, 1 production, 2 culture. Yeah, that's, that's pretty nice. Let's go here. So I can upgrade my alliance. It's a cultural alliance, which is great for cultural victories. Gives you uh, more great people. Am I working anything that is not improved? The answer is no. I actually want to lock one of these ones. I lose a little bit of production, but this city already has quite a lot of production. And uh, I get uh, more food and two gold, so, you know, why not? And I still have another good tile up here for my next growth. How about this guy? This guy could swap that because the capital is not using it. And, uh, yeah, I could lock it because this tile is kind of rubbish and I can get some, some fish. So let's do that. Okay, so we have a guy down here. Do I still have a trade route to Blue Congo? Yeah, I do. So I'm going to send just another one to Green Congo. Money is doing, it's going pretty well right now. That's great. This guy's a medic. Okay. 
this guy he's what Orator. okay let's leave him here maybe he will die eventually I really need my this guy to die oh he cannot move yet let's see if he dies on this turn Oh, nice. So I had a spy in Delhi who had to leave, but uh, still good news, although rebellion, mm, not so great. What's the situation with Eras now? Well, for another 11 turns, Gandhi is actually in a dark age. Uh, this guy is in a normal age, so maybe he manages to keep the city. And this, this other neighbor is also in a dark age. All in all, he should be able to keep the city somehow. Arya Varman has declared war on someone, but which Congo exactly? Uh, this guy? Yeah. So this Congo, that's a large empire, the, the Orange Congo is the largest empire in the game, I think, which is also not leaving me to this. Um, it's at war with the Purple Congo and with the Khmer again which annoys me a lot because the Khmer have converted this guy to Buddhism and I want that to stay that way ideally okay so we have a capital now an embassy sorry not a capital we always had a capital okay so uh, oh they already have ironclad well that's a nine factory here so we're going to have a factory here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, it doesn't really reach this city. So we could have another one or just a shipyard or both actually, but this looks like it's more interesting. Uh, buying a new is with faith, definitely not. Ooh, bear spice, that's nice. City state units can blah, blah, blah. Uh huh. This is not too bad if I wanted to keep Antanarivo. Um, city state units gain plus four combat strength if you're the city state suzerain. Problem is they will still suck and for example now Antanarivo has like one unit or zero so it's not like such a big difference. I think I'm going to go with intelligence agency. I think it makes more sense at the, po at the time. And the Khmer are building units. Now, I would love it if they just built Apostles, to be honest with you. Okay, let's just wait there. This guy's a martyr, yeah? Yeah, good. So hopefully he will die. Um, let me think about this. So, mm, this is a Banza Wembo which already has one to Hong Kong and uh, one to here as well Mangan Puka, but how about this city? Oh, Puka already has one, okay how about Kindu? Kindu doesn't have any they could build one that wouldn't be terrible, I think If I sent one up here, that would be a very nice road, actually. Not a very nice trade route, unfortunately, but a very nice road. Mm -hmm. I want to chop all of this stuff. I think I, I pretty much do. We have a bunch of actions, so why not? Okay, where are we going now? Let me think about this. Um, so Gandhi is the least dangerous guy, but I can't really steal a lot of stuff from him. Mm, and I don't really need to steal great works in this game because I should, uh, you know, he's going to struggle now without his capital. Mm. Who has rocketry? Oh, my ally has rocketry. Well, that's a bit annoying. 
Okay, so we are going to go to the further Congo simply because um, they won't attack me. They are they are too far. They are too busy going at war with the Khmer all the time. And I'm just going to probably steal some Eurekas, and uh, that that really should do it. I don't know for how long will Antanarivo survive, but it doesn't look like a lot. Let's hope I can get to steal before this violet or purple Congo attacks me. Yeah, the loyalty situation not changing yet. Completed a trade route, five turns, five points for a golden age, only eleven turns. Still no more barbarians over here, so let's explore that part of the world with the medic, which I definitely don't need. Oh, wait a second. This guy should do his thing. Yay. I forgot about that. So, theming is what exactly? Same type from different artists. So here you have religious, religious, or religious. Bosch, Rublev, and Bosch. And this is religious from Bosch as well. I wonder if I can get religious from someone else. Still Rublev, so no. Um, maybe my ally? Still Rublev. Okay, so no. I need another artist to bring some religious stuff to the table. Q Ying is going to bring landscapes, so no. It's very difficult to get the theming bonus uh, with uh, art stuff. That's why I usually go for archaeology because it's easier to get the theming bonus. Ooh, that's actually pretty nice. I don't exactly need these open borders though. So I could just get more gold. Ooh. Okay, cool stuff. So, we got to sell that extra thingy. Okay, they are dividing the attack, which is not a great idea. But if they destroy the bombard, actually, the walls could hold. Okay, so I think uh, my ally has declared war. Yeah on this fella who is at war now with the other two Congos. I still cannot get an embassy here. How about you? We really cannot get an embassy either. Everybody hates us for no reason. This guy is still unfriendly, but we are at 14. We are at zero, actually, here. But this doesn't update in real time, this game, unlike a Civ 4, which was a lot better in that aspect. Okay, we don't have a lot of factories right now. Let's go and get this. Stockholm gives you more great uh, people points. So that's awesome. But I need, yeah, I need a lot of envoys. If I hadn't turned here. Um, I'm not recovering the suzerain status here. Simply because this guy is attacking the city, so I might just lose all of those, those uh, envoys eventually. Delhi doesn't give me any food, that's surprising. It does give me science, but just one point. Three culture against two, one face does the same. Buddhism, I prefer Buddhism instead of Hinduism. And this one gives me more gold, so I'm just going to do this one here. I'm sticking to foreign trade routes right now. I'm not uh, going up here, though it would be a nice road, but this city anyway is not going to bring troops up here, so not a big deal. I'm going to just chop this stuff. This guy is going to Kinshasa. Huh? How many trade routes do I have to purple guy? Still a bunch of them. So... Okay. 
let me think about this what can i get that is actually very nice we want to get food here i wouldn't mind growing a little bit you know what i mean for food for production only for gold but still Let's do this because this guy actually needs production as well. What can I buy here? Shipyard. I could start using my money to buy shipyards everywhere because I have harbors everywhere. We are going to do this. Um, I think we are actually. So, Nkunga. We have more production now. Yeah, these tiles are mostly nice i could put fishing boats over there that should be okay in order trade route is done but i need another four points and i i honestly don't know where am i going to get them in the next 10 turns okay so gandhi made peace now okay 15 population so that's another point i only need three now that's nice. So, claim great person. How about that? Another great writer. That's another point. I only need two. Oh, that's interesting. How many turns for another great guy? Almost none. Like two turns here. I will get Q Ying. That's one point in two turns. <coughs> Sorry. So, I only need one more point in the next nine turns. If a trade route is completed, in the next nine turns which is happening here or this one actually only eight well that's interesting i might actually get a golden age so if this lady settles which will happen one turn from now then if this guy doesn't get a, a golden age himself he's in a dark age right now i might actually convert an Arivo once they lose it. They didn't kill the bombard, that's a shame. They should have gone for the bombard immediately. Anyway, mm, I don't want to build any more walls, I want to wait for steel. Water park? No, not right now. um shipyard here to production only bonus production equal to adjacency gold bonus of its district yeah that's two in this case uh, plus one food plus one gold mm. two production is not really great and do i want to do my specific district this is going to give me error points but uh, yeah, I will have to lose one of those things because it has to be on a forest, which is a bit annoying. I could do a farm here to get more food from the rice. That's also nice. Actually, yeah, well, this guy is going to get this first. So, um, <laughs> do I keep the district for the water park? I think that's, that's appropriate. Yeah, let's go. No, wait, you know what? I don't know what I'm going to do. Archaeologist? Yeah, archaeologist. Let's go archaeologist. Okay, uh, here. Art museum, I guess. Ancient walls, just in case I get attacked before steel, because this guy is pretty far from everybody. Ooh, maybe. One tourism after advancing to conservation. So that's not terrible. I can get tourism from Asian walls. I forgot about that, so I could build a few of them. Uh, this guy is going to need to repeat some stuff. He was getting two production here. He would get only one here. So I'm thinking I'm going to stay with the two production one. One food as well. That's actually a very decent trade route. I'm going to just repeat it. Ah, that's funny. Let's do this. 
Ooh, okay. So, where am I going to put some great uh, writing stuff? Mulumbi or Kindu? Kindu here. And Mulumbi down there. So... I think I prefer to expand here faster. So yeah, we're going to go here in two turns, that's fine. We are going to wait. And you, my friend, we're not going to go down because we already are going to get a builder down there very soon. We're going to go here instead. So we are finally going to get the irrigation on turn 198 uh, because I didn't have any irrigation resources, you know. So no, 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 no! Don't kill this guy. Kill that. Kill the martyr. The man who has grit enough. Okay, wait a second. Um, I got something. Irrigation. Yeah. Okay. Fine. This guy will go there. I really want the martyr to die. So let's hide this fella for now. Right. Uh huh. If the Khmer are trying to get this city, they could do it, but from the north, I think it will be better. This lady is now established here, which is nice. Uh, let's go ballistics again. Um, this is a promoted crossbow, huh? Okay. I need to start getting some sort of army because I will eventually get attacked. It is just a matter of time, you know. Yeah, let's go here. We could build a farm there and then get uh, fishing boats down here. How many actions? Two? Yeah. Farm and fishing boats. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, so this guy two turns to get 13 population. So that's another district actually. Pretty nice. There are a lot of things that we could do, but a farm here is actually nice. So we're going to do that. There the lady's imagination is very well. And how about Delhi? Are they going to be able to keep it? Yes, they are. Full loyalty in two turns. Nice stuff. I hope they get walls here very soon. That uh, is important. So they don't lose the city. And they also got... Uh, what is this? Mahabodhi Temple. Yeah, that's nice. There you go. We got a relic. And the relic, because we are Congo, is giving us for faith a tourism. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Now if they get the alignment, of course, it's not going to be so great. Unless I get Cristo Redentor, which would be very nice. Okay, nice. Claim great person, great artist, sure thing. Another point. I only need one more. How about the great musician? Not soon enough. Um, great scientist though, I could purchase this guy, but we're going to think about that, if we are one turn away from losing the golden age we could purchase Alfred Nobel, which I don't want to do because he's not really a great, uh, an amazing great person, mm, this guy somehow getting <laughs> great profit points, I think thanks to Mahabodhi Temple or something, I don't know. Uh, it doesn't matter, it's Congo, so I will be getting Grand Merchant points, yeah, 4.5, 6 Great Engineer points, yeah, not gonna happen, Great Admiral points, of course, I have a lot of them, anyway, my capital can build something, how are we doing now that we have the zoo, happiness a little bit better, not so great, though um factory sure because this factory affects the capital affects this city down here 
this city there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Umbuka. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it doesn't affect Mbasa so you. So here we are going to need one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, here we are going to need another factory. Six. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mbasa Wembo is going to need its own factory. Mm -hmm. And we're going no, to need more tourism. Yeah. We're already getting there. Gandhi is not going to be leading for much longer. So, situation here. We're not going to grow anytime soon. We could get more ivory. So I am going to get more ivory for sure. And then maybe I can clean that. I don't know. How many... Okay, this is... Oh, this is a warrior. Let's get a musketman because why not? Let's get a farm here. That gives me more food for Mulumbi. Cool stuff. I could actually do this. Oh, wait. I want to lose the factory. Yeah, five turns to grow. That's nice. Then I will recover that production. But I'm no hurry right now. This guy will get the farm over there. Another great artist. I don't have any landscapes at all. So that's a shame. Anyway, which museum has room for something? Mulumbi. Where's Mulumbi? Down here. Yeah. Okay. So let's travel to Mulumbi. That's nice. And uh, we are building a farm there for sure. Kindu is lucky that. Yeah. Okay. Good. So we get the same amount of food, but we got some extra food thanks to chopping that marsh and uh, the farm gives you like uh, 0 0.5 housing, so that's always a good thing to have. Okay, so this fella can go up again. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's a bit risky. Hopefully they won't attack me. I don't want them to lose an Apostle. Okay, so do I want to lock this tile? Where am I working here? I could lose quite a lot of production if I lock that tile. Okay, so I'm going to leave things like that. We're growing one, so I'm probably going to get it anyway. So yeah, let's do this. We're going to lose the production for one turn. Not a big deal, I'm making a lot of money now thanks to that. You know what? Let's purchase a shipyard. That gives me more production towards the archaeologist. I don't know if I did gain any turns, by the way. Mm -hmm. Yes, nice. Nice, nice, nice. So maybe here we get more Buddhism because of that fight. So that's good. That's good news. And so, Mbansa Soyo. Okay, ah, this guy is rebelling already. And I'm not even in the Golden Age, so that's nice. So, we need to send some troops up here. Just not here, because this guy needs a market. Um, okay, so this fella. I think I'm not going to chop this. I might want to get a neighborhood there eventually. Um, so there isn't really a lot to do down here, unless I purchase this tile. But that's food, which I already have. I have quite a lot of it, actually. So, yeah. So I want to keep this and get a lumber mill for production. That might be the situation, actually. This is a hill. That is a hill. So this city could get it. We're getting the turtles, which is fine. But I don't want to lose this to Buenos Aires. To, sorry, Hong Kong. Um, it doesn't look like I could lose it, though. I have a lot more culture than them. I guess I will wait until I get the antiquity site. You know what? Let's not let's not risk it. 
Let's just skip it because eventually I will have to build a mine there. I will leave this guy with one action, just ready to build a mine over here. In the meantime, we're going to travel all the way here. Got this coal for one of these cities that need the production. This fella, let's go here, keep going. Yep, that's nice. We'll do that, which gives me even more food here, which is obviously pretty nice. Growing again in 10, but I already have uh, room for all of the districts that I need, so that's quite nice actually. Mm -hmm. Ballistics soon, so I would want to upgrade these crossbows for sure. Okay. This guy has two builds actually, so what we're going to do is we're going to travel down here and eventually get that extra turtle. Nice, we got a golden age. Ooh, Rural Valley, that's a good one. If you're going for science victory, of course, for cultural victory. It's one thing to surmise what happened, but we don't speculate on that until ballistics confirms what happened. Okay, another point. Rolls upgraded. If you don't read the newspaper, you're uninformed. If you read the newspaper, okay, it must be built on hills. It gets me more tourism for seaside resorts. And I could get a bunch of seaside resorts, so I want Crystal Redentor. We need hills. And who's going to build it? Oh, Ambassa Congo could totally do it. After the factory, I can put Crystal Redentor right here. This city has a bunch of hills. I could also put Crystal Redentor here. Right. Right. I think I'm going to put it next to the coast. It's uh, it looks nicer. Unfortunately, I, c I cannot put it next to the theater square. So many hills around Mbasa Congo, really. That's nice. Okay, so scientific theory plus one food from plantation. Yeah, I don't really have a lot of plantations. I have a total of uh, zero. <laughs> so that's not going to happen. We want to go to steel. So what do we need? We need siege tactics, which we could boost with uh, two bombards. Not so difficult, actually. Then we have to go military science. And then we have to go rifling. I would love to kill a unit with a knight. Okay, you know what? Eventually I will get that one. So what we're going to do is we are going to get scientific theory because eventually we will want to go uh, to radio which uh, needs it yeah to get uh, CSI resort we also need to go to computers which gives you more tourism and that one also needs scientific theory so we're going to get it now we're going to wait a little bit for steel because I want to boost that stuff by having two bombards That's fine. So I'm going to upgrade to fill cannon. Yeah, that's good. Uh, pum, 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 you, my friend, are going to get. Um, I don't know what you're going to get. You're still going towards. Okay, there was in, in capitalism. There was a policy very nice. Mm. To culture into science for every international trade route that could be up to 16 culture and 16 science 16 science could be really nice mm -hmm. i'm not going to build three stock exchanges at all in this game uh, so the other thing i need is crash for this i need ideology and i need mobilization i could totally boost mobilization that should be easy to do actually um, I also kind of need this. Well, I'm not going to get a naturalist. That's just too much faith. Three envoys, blah blah blah. And tourism from walls, so that's not too bad. 
breathtaking appeal is not going to happen. Okay, let's go capitalism because I'm definitely not going to boost it anytime and I want the market economy. So, okay. Um, here, I think we're going art museum. Looks like that's what we need right now, more than anything else. What can we get here? Um, I think we're going to go this side. We're not going to put her in a city state, so these two ones are useless, but for amenities is always good. Um, this guy definitely not, right? We already said that these ones are not necessary at this point. Uh, space program or nuclear armament not gonna happen. Oh, plus one production per turn from each city resource. This is actually very good. So we're going to confirm this one. Where is he? He's here and I have um, iron and stone. And don't I have any fish? I don't have any fish. Oh, I lost the crabs. Okay, that's annoying. Oh, and I have cattle here, so that, sh that should be plus three, right? Mm -hmm. Plus two towards humans. Plus one. Okay, so I think this is not going to tell me anything until next turn. Anyway, I think it's like a plus three over there, which is nice. It's like 10% extra. Anyway. Um, change policies maybe let's remove the builder thing and so let's see wild card great artists I don't really need any more great artist points I'm getting all of them we want more great scientist points maybe but probably not um, what else can we get that is nice? One culture and one science from international trade routes. That would be something like six or seven science right now, which is not too bad. Or uh, do I get this? Plus 50% culture is city population is 10 or higher, plus 50%. Uh, yeah, that's not too awful. A lot of amenities, that's also not too bad at all. I could get this until I have stuff like uh, stadiums or things like that. That would give me a lot of nice bonuses. Establish governors with at least three promotions, probably plus one amenity, plus one housing. That's three of them already. Could be another one very soon. Industrial era and later wonders. This is not going to be bad because I'm going to go with Bolshevik Theater, Cristo Redentor, and um, Eiffel Tower. So this is actually pretty nice. But not right now, a little bit later. I think I'm going to go with culture and science because I, uh, I like culture and I need the science. And this one, buildings and campuses, yeah. Nah, this is not going to be so much because I only have three campuses. Uh, 50%. I only have two universities. Oh, this may be a little bit more science, but uh, no culture at all. So let's put this one here for now. But we have a bunch of economic policies there that could be very useful. This guy will have to sleep until I get a new art museum. Which is gonna take a while, unfortunately. Oh no, three turns. That's nice. Rebellion in two. Okay, I need to get ready for that. I really want to kill a unit with a knight. That is something that needs to happen. Okay, so who's going to build Crystal Redentor? It's going to be my capital, so let's go here. This guy is getting what exactly? Hong Kong, yeah, that's not going to be the one I'm going to repeat. Um,
but nice, nice. Also gives me more food, so it could be. Or I could get it from Mansa Soyo instead, or from Manga. Does Manga have a trade route at all? It has one. This guy has one as well. They are getting two production each. And Umpuka is getting an internal trade route for, for production. You know what? Let's go here. Let's go to the capital because I want to get all of the production towards uh, Cristo Redentor, basically. Okay. Still boost. Foment and rest. Ooh, foment and rest. I could actually use those ones with these northern cities. Especially Kumasi. That could be nice. Oh, I have a military that's better than him, I think. That's giving me a bonus. Martyr, please. No, not at all. Yeah, I want none of these things. Um, whatever. I don't really care. Martyr is the only promotion that could be useful for me. Still though, we have to go to the Khmer land somehow. So let's go there. Um, what is this guy going to do? Asian walls, just in case I get attacked in the north and then I will get one tourism. So why not? This guy is going to wait here until I get that tile and also until I get the antiquity from this thing. First archaeologist is coming, so it's nice. You need production, my friend. So this trade route gives you two. That's a nice one, for sure. Uh -huh. No trade routes to the green guy is going to give me more than that. So... They want an internal one. I definitely don't want an internal one because I'm going to capitalism. Uh -huh. This is going to give me one everywhere. I might still want it though, just to have one towards Gandhi. So let's do it. Let's do that. Rebellion in one. Okay, let's go here. Let's go there and just wait, and just wait, and just wait. Okay then, this is all good. And we get the fishing boat and we lock it. Good. Oh, I could have built a lumber mill here. I forgot about that. Or just chop the art museum, actually. Anyway. I can go like there, for example. I'm just using the Apostles to explore, which is a lot of fun. Cool. That's what I wanted to see. Okay, let's see. This major defeat at the time. Stalemate. Okay, better than nothing. I really want to kill this fella. Do I risk it? Because otherwise this guy is going to kill that fella. So I'm going to risk it. Yes. Awesome stuff. And we're going to do that. Cool. Okay. So let's see if we can take Antanarivo before this fella here takes it. We want a tray route, okay. Okay, this guy on the other hand he has a better army than mine, so he's not very impressed. I'm definitely not going to do a joint war, but I'm happy to sell you my marble. Ooh, looks like we can get quite a lot of money here. He really needs the marble. How much? 25? 24, sure. And a little bit more here. 
Ja. Gustav. Okay, 23. And 24 every turn for Marvel, which I have a lot of. So that's amazing. Let's accept it. Thank you, my friend. You're welcome, my friend. Okay, we're going to get a Golden Age very soon. We go here. This guy needs to heal, like right now. Okay, this guy is retreating, which is awesome. Can I take the city right now? I actually can. That's awesome. Keep city, liberate the founder. Nice. Super nice. Stockholm has declared war on Ambassador Zinka. Why? Oh, because your suzerain is another Ambassador Zinka. So, um, whatever. I don't know what that means, to be honest. Okay, and I recover plus 2% culture for each great person, which is a lot in my particular case. And uh, I wonder if I want to send three guys to Hong Kong, because it's going to be the only one that lasts uh, forever, basically, in this game. So that's interesting. I will want to get water parks, that's for sure. Bolshoi Theater here, definitely not. Medieval walls. Tourism after conservation. I'm thinking about building walls just for the tourism because it doesn't look like I'm really going to get attacked uh, before steel. How are we doing with happiness though? Uh, more or less okay for now. Let's go medieval walls. I need to get even more money just to buy shipyards all over the place and improve my um, my production basically. Yeah, this one gives me two production. I'm going to repeat it because this guy needs the production. It just it just happens. He just needs it. I need to send a builder up here. Where are my builders? This guy was coming here. He has four builds. Okay, let's do that. I want that uh, marble. So we're going to get more spies and more governor points. So that's good, obviously. And when are we going to get that tie with the turtles? Oh, in one turn. How about that? Cool stuff. Well, this was very good. My whole um, free city idea worked really well. Claims that cannot be tested. My alliance has expired. Will this guy still get it? Uh, yeah. No, wait. Now is the time to do the cultural thing. So, how are we doing here? We have level one. Oh, he doesn't have a trade route to me. Well, that's a shame. Um, anyway. We're going to get here soon at level 2. So level 1, uh, yeah, more culture, which is nice. And uh, level 2, yeah. Yeah, cool, more great people. That's excellent. That is absolutely excellent. Okay, then. Economics, uh, Big Ben is already built, so we have to go for steel. Two bombards, I guess we are not going to get the two bombards on time, this is just too fast. We did get this one though, the night one, uh, that's pretty good. Being the nitro mine is not gonna happen, unfortunately. And uh, coal mine and an ironclad. Okay. How many turns can I get for this? Quite a lot of them, because this, this technology is expensive. 
So I might want to get an ironclad after all. Um, to get an ironclad though, I need to deviate from that and go to steam power. And I have zero shipyards right now. No, I have one actually. I could get a second one. Hmm, interesting. How much for a shipyard? Okay, next turn I can buy the second one. Yeah, then get that. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. So do I want to keep Alfred Nobel? I mean, it will help me, but 23 points is just very little. And then it's just one freaking Eureka. So overall, not great. Um, but I'm going to get him, whatever. I'm going to get him simply because it's just easier to do that. Forget about everything else, really. Factory here needs to happen. Unfortunately, that guy doesn't have enough production to go wrong without the factory. Crystal Redentor for sure. 22 turns. Boom. Boosted advanced flight. I would very much prefer something like the internet, but whatever. Okay, so uh, what's the era situation right now? Okay, we don't know yet. So this guy is actually going to skip a turn. Let's see what happens with the era situation. He's in conversion. Let's do that. Uh -huh. Look at that. I got a pikeman for free and 30 gold. Okay, you're going to heal, you're going to heal. He wants a luxury and item for another luxury and some money. Ooh. Nice. These guys are in are a bit desperate for resources, which is very good for me because I have a lot of them and I'm not using them. Well I don't have nitre, but I have everything else. And I'm not using it. So cool. Yep, I have two Mercury, I could use one instance. Cool stuff. Lots of money now. And it's not even counting the new thing, so it's going to be 285 per turn now. We do have a Golden Age. A new market, so that's another trade rod capacity now. Trigger Eureka for chemistry, probably not going to happen. We are in a Golden Age, so the brightness is up for the whole game. Um, pretty amazing and this bullet guy is also in a golden age so that's that is super annoying because I cannot use my golden age to take Kumasi so I'm not going to use my spy to reduce the loyalty now because during a golden age uh, it's just ridiculous so your traders cannot be plundered international traders per plus three gold per specialty district in the foreign city that's nice Campus, District, Science, Agency provides production as well. So this is going to give me more production towards Crystal Rentor right now and Eiffel Tower later. Wait a second. How many turns do we have here? 40. How many turns to start building Eiffel Tower? 4, 8, 15, 20 something. Yeah, because this, I mean, I have to get this and then get the ironclad, so I'm just going to go straight to steel. Yeah, so 4, 8, 15, 26. So during 14 turns I could use this 10%, which isn't bad at all. No. Cities with government already fit plus 50 tourists for more wonders. 100% tourism to all national parks. So national parks I don't have, I will not have. World Wonders, I have um, this one here, and I have a governor, and I want have this one there, and I also have a governor. So that's plus 50% tourism right there, which isn't bad, but isn't also great. Now, 20 turns from now, I will have Crystal Rendor, and that will still leave me another 20 turns of Golden Age, so that would be 
in our wonder. So to the production of uh, Chris Orientor or the tourism for Chris Orientor? This is a good question. Well, the thing is I first need to get Chris Orientor to get the tourism, so... More money obviously always great, but my economy is doing so good that I don't need even more money. Especially because I'm going to capitalism and I'm going to get that as well. Okay, I will get the, the extra production from campus. That's, that's going to give me extra production in this city that has a plus three campus or plus four, I don't remember. I think it's plus three only. Uh, still though, that's another three production to the city which uh, really needs production. And then my city down there and the capital is going to get more production from the campus here which has a plus two i think and uh, also 10 percent production for crystal rentor and eventually eiffel tower and i could use this to get the bolshoi theater somewhere i don't know where though it's not so easy because here for example 64 that's rubbish water park mm, not a terrible idea actually but first, let's go trader. And uh, we are going to assign this guy. Also here. We already have one spy there. We're going to get both of them there to get a lot of stuff from that uh, bonus from selling a guy and getting more information and all of that stuff. Are there more barbarians that I could just convert? maybe let's check the south over here this pikeman can go like here for example because why not and that's it for now uh thank you for watching guys next video we're going to use our golden age to get some nice world wonders hopefully crystal rentor and eiffel tower see you guys later